Hi guys, welcome to my uh, system here. It's an old computer system, but it's flying like crazy. So that is the latest Ergonlex XL uh, ISO that I'm using. Blank is up there, activated. And um, the topic of the video is this icon. Everything started with this icon. This is nice. In my standards, this is nice. They're all white and against black. But I used to have something um, round and blue when choosing Sardi icons. And this is Surfen that I've chosen. But um, it was not supposed to be like that. It had to be like this. And some of my machines had it, other, others didn't have it. And you may have noticed a new update for Sardi and Surfen. That was just to ensure that we got these nice um, yeah, design for Flameshot. Now, I have been in contact with the developer. That's the best thing you can do. I think I've closed it again. Yes, I've rebooted already. But um, if you got an issue with um, a package and it's not from us, then you should ask the guys who develop it. So that's what I did. I contacted this uh, developer. Oh, it's open up here. It's already open on another screen. That's why I said, oh, what's going on? All right, so this is gone for me. So you make an account, you sign in on GitHub, and then you ask, you ask your issues, and you ask your questions. Can this be done? Can that be done? Um, bugs, Wayland, you see all kinds of things here. So I have put, there we go. I have put on the repo, type update. You get all the packages in, not the packages, but where they are and what is there. And there's a new one, sudo pacman minus s flame shot is normal. That's the normal guy coming from Arch Linux, and this guy is coming from us, the Git version. So the AUR, the maintainer, so it's not developed by us. Again, AUR is somebody else maintaining a package build. We just build it for you. So if there are issues, you go to the AUR from Arch Linux and ask, hey guys, uh, can you update the package build, please? Always with a please. So if you install this one, like I've done, then you'll see the icon will be surely like this. So that's um, the fix, that's the option just for the icon. But since it's a Git version, it means it's the very, very, very last version that the developer ever created. And I've saw already some new things. The take screenshots is similar, if not completely the same. So this is how we communicate, communicate with each other and um, make a copy, copy paste it in the memory or gonna write it down on as a PNG or something like that or even more things. So check it out. It's also fun with the right mouse click, change your colors. We have here some all kinds of new things here. Yep, new things, cool, cool, cool. So it's great, close again and right mouse click again and choose a color like this and oops, that's moving. And when you choose something, it's going to be green, all stuff like that. So that's what we know. That's already, uh, was already died there. This is a new thing, open launcher, rectangular region, full screen on monitors. Take a new screenshot. And then we can save it if we want to cancel. Saving cancelled. So full screen, no delay, etc delay no delay one second two seconds take new screenshot and there you go so things change that's good progress right so this thing and latest uploads is also new i think screen history there and configuration is still more or less the same if i remember correctly this is new increase and decrease tool. They're not activated. And file, oops, my mistake. File name is still normal. General is still the same. I did change this already. Uh, don't want to see this to welcome message on launch. And that's it. So if you want it, if you think it's interesting, we help it or we use it to help you guys is okay this here and then we start explaining things watch out for this watch out for that and some text in there and off you go 
If you scroll up, the letters become bigger. The same goes for your arrow. If you scroll up, it's really gonna emphasize what you mean. All right, cheers.